GM and welcome Neo Knights to the Week in Review, your one-stop shop for everything that happened in the Neo ecosystem over the past week. As always, if you appreciate what we're churning out week after week, don't hesitate to hit that thumbs up button and to follow our YouTube feed. Let's get this week rolling. Neo Global Development released their general monthly report for November 2023, which noted the Neo EVM sidechain naming campaign, of which Neo X emerged the winner, and gas listing on the Demex exchange Perpetual Markets, along with much more details. Melkdao released Neo Trail on its Melk Bot, which is an educational learn to earn platform that's aimed at teaching people how to use new blockchain ecosystems and was a grant shares recipient in June 2023. The tool offers a hands-on approach to understanding blockchain and cryptocurrencies by rewarding users with Melk tokens for completing tasks and onboarding into new ecosystem dApps. The Melk DAO team has also provided similar educational trails for both Solana and Polygon ecosystems. At the time of its approval, the team was rewarded with 6,670 gas, which was worth approximately $15,000 at the time, and four members from GrantShares voted in favor of the proposal. Congratulations to the Melkdown team, and everybody listening to this should go check it out. Neo will participate in Bitland, a 3D metaverse world that has been built for the Bitcoin ecosystem. Bitland will leverage 3D Worlds and the new BRC20 standard that has been enabled by Bitcoin's ordinal inscriptions. Neo will be involved in the 3D metaverse by actively advertising its brand throughout different maps. There are a few ongoing campaigns in the Neo ecosystem right now. The first are two Zealy campaigns which are being ran by the Flamingo Finance and Meme to Earn teams where users can complete various different social media tasks and compete for a rewards pool of $1,000 for the Flamingo campaign and $420 for the Meme to Earn campaign. Additionally, a new ongoing weekly campaign for the Neo Gleam is ongoing right now and will conclude on January 18th. Participants can win 1 of 10 gas tokens by answering 10 of 10 multiple choice questions correctly. If the competition has more than 100 participants each week, gas will be added to the following week's rewards pool. Axlabs has launched One Click Node, a node setup service which is designed to ease the deployment of Web3 infrastructure. This service is tailored for developers looking to leverage cloud providers for their blockchain projects. On its release, One Click Node supports Neo N3 mainnet and testnet with plans for other L1s and L2s on the roadmap. Neo SPCC released version 0.105.0 of Neo Go, which included a litany of bug fixes and improvements. This update focuses on improving the RPC infrastructure and the command line interface utility, including the introduction of a new mechanism for awaiting transaction responses. This past week, my Neo News Today co-editor and I, Edge, started a new venture via the Smart Economy podcast where we're going to focus on trying to host weekly conversations that are bite size and consumable at around 30 minutes or less. And we'll talk about the things that are going on in the Neo and broader blockchain and cryptocurrency industry. This past week, we had our first, what we're calling right now, crypto coffee and blockchain beer, which focused on the Neo X EVM sidechain, secure bridges, and bringing liquidity into the Neo ecosystem. The next Twitter Spaces event we'll be hosting will take place on January 18th via the Smart Economy Podcast Twitter page. And lastly, in upcoming events, don't forget on June 18th, Edge and I will be hosting a crypto coffee and blockchain beer on the Smart Economy Podcast Twitter page. And on January 30th, Meme to Earn will be hosting a community fireplace and Flamingo Finance will be hosting a community lagoon on their official Discord servers, respectively. And that just about wraps up another great week in the NEO ecosystem. As always, if you appreciate what you're seeing, don't hesitate to hit that thumbs up button and to follow our YouTube feed. 
And if you're a NEO token holder, please consider voting for NEO News today as your council representative. We've proudly been serving the NEO ecosystem since 2017 and will continue to put portions of our council income directly back into ecosystem growth initiatives. With all that said, we look forward to catching you guys next week.